adoption. So we're going to make a video for the adoption. Let's make a little bit more touchy feely with Barnett. I don't know if it was just coincidental or if she was doing it. Let's Play get that away from my dog. <laughs> 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 my dog is so dumb. It's a battle pooper. We drove horses? 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 Uh, let me just go get them. Oh, that's you. Let's shout. Let's shower. Shower him. I just want to shower him. Like, in your budget. Get that away from my towel. Um, to get them out of the Oh, does that? Okay. Let's get our first level. It's, it's, it's really crazy Where because we are like so, like, just in case one another. Yeah. It's a bite that's really like. We're gonna get a Sunina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're thinking like really slow. And he is kind of like this. Yeah. 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 Ye
on the YouTube. Get my YouTube channel. Okay, we're gonna hold up this over again, 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 again. Okay, we're gonna next uh to this uh to this um again. This is a dahoot. Did you just know that's a dahoot? And that you else to be a put a uh, churchy wax. What is like that? Of course, it. But for what is it? Jessica is God's name of the way. Let's go. 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 let very sexual, showy way. They seem to all My be in a different headspace. House for the dad who I'm so rich. I'm really far of course, dad, my house is so rich with when he kisses a nice, me, it doesn't beautiful feel house. Right? Can see this look at comfortable. So if I can just hear his voice and grab his hand, then we're good. But. Good. Like all the other things good. that just don't feel good. right. I think we go home and look okay, at my happens. house, guys. So beautiful. I don't feel right wearing this morning based look on everyone. how I feel. Look at it's my not to say it can't work. Look at my but house, guys. I'm not, you know, really. Would you back Because I just want this. I love being around her. I love everything. Her mouth, her smile. And I'm not... I just feel like, though, Jessica's trying to find something wrong and something that there's nothing wrong. Like, there's nothing there's wrong with that connection with me. Right there's no swimming pool right here in the And I keep battling, I keep fighting, and then, you know, even now, we're when she, off the it's like, light this came out of nowhere. We had a perfect night, and... Off I think that's what kind of hurts because uh, I'm just like, I feel like I've fought and keep fighting and keep fighting and keep fighting and I keep, I keep going back to the reveal and it's like, it's like that's my person and I always fight for what I believe in. I always fight for the people that I want in my life. It's it's like I'm never I never give up. I also don't want to pressure anybody. I'm here. The strength. I can be that rock that we keep talking about. But you know, I need the same. Why did you have to leave? Alone with all my thoughts. building together as a couple and then on top of that trying to think about planning a wedding With a dog, he is. <laughs> I'm looking at TV. 
for me. This is for all the YouTube channel. You want to like, comment on the You don't. So I'll just no. see everybody. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Like, did I look like what you thought? I was like, you know, like, just like my hair. It's a beautiful. You want me to like ass. What? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not beautiful. Look at the comment of yeah, my videos then YouTube channel. Do it. Uh, so we're gonna it's sun, we're gonna go now. So we're gonna we are happy for each other, but we've also had very serious conversations like I've never had in my whole life. It's my life. I love my life. Yeah, you know, can I come such a level inside the pod that I, I expected that to carry outside of here? Right. I expected right. it to be a Go simple on one. You know, you're still trying to put a face to the name. Even days later, you're like, wow, Ooh. this is who I was talking to the whole time. Okay, go to and it's, yeah. it's still a challenge. You. I mean, how do you how do you feel like you and Timmy have been coaching? Like, do you think that it's been Ooh. pretty solid and it's like, pretty close to I'm how I was in the pod? Yeah. 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 It's crazy, yeah. but yeah. yeah. What's up, Jess? Well, last night was fun. We were all kind of like, yeah, no, really yeah. have some sexual or sexual something. <laughs> I'm physically attracted to Barnett. My natural instinct, if it were pre pod Jess, would be to go to Barnett. The most attractive guy that I just normally gravitate to. That's totally a different from the person I thought. You like our relationship. I feel like was totally, like seriously, every totally relationship I had was different. Totally. But like we did have a connection. I, know. It was, I mean, it was a strong connection. Yeah. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I mean, I got really emotionally invested in that, and then I know, I you know, did I too. Know. I mean, I'm happy. So. Yeah. If Barnett and I continued our relationship outside of the pod, you would see a totally different Barnett, an introspective Barnett, a sophisticated, you know, holding himself high Barnett. It would be complete opposite of what you see with him and Amber. But it's interesting to see that he chose something completely opposite of kind of what we had going. So how is uh, Mark? I mean, for struggling for sure. I see. Like the physical for me is not really hard. It's just not like too hard. It's like we connected so much in the pod, and then it's like I guess seeing each other, like each other. You know what I mean? So I'm still trying to figure that out, but like. I'm gonna go down to the hair. Then go somewhere. So, my biggest thing, like, I love to shit. I've never felt like this about someone in my time. I did the first time I felt sorry. And then I keep fighting, I keep fighting, I keep fighting, but then damn, it's like, yo, I'm gonna keep fighting. At some point, she has to believe it and see it too. You shouldn't have to fight forever. Talking with Amber made me feel better a little bit, but I still feel as though I need to go talk to Jess. It's almost like, let's go back to square one, where we started, and communicate, and just get into what we're feeling, and how we got here in the first place, which is opening up, and being more and more, and being who we are internally, and just saying, hey, this is what's going on, what's going on with you, and just figuring it out from there. You want the other person to be all in, too. You want that reassurance. I feel it. Gotta embrace the mess. If you can manage it together. I guess he came. Eh. I'm just falling in love. Falling in love is scary as hell. It flips everything upside down. Tonight, I figured we could have a romantic dinner and stargaze. Open. Ah, 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 ah. You've been out in the sun shining all night. Yeah. Your entire life, but really, you've been in the dark. And then someone just opens up your eyes and goes, well, is this it? I don't know. I think so. Maybe. Cool. I like it. Thanks. So it's exciting, and it's amazing, and it's warm, and it's terrifying, because someone taps into you, 
And you're like, alright. You're welcome. Love is beautiful. You know when people like name stars? I want that. Well, we will find a star mm -hmm. and we will name it after you. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. I'm feeling really confused. Um, I don't know where Jessica's head's at right now. I'm confused as how someone could say yes to someone in the pods and fall for someone and then gut punches me and says she doesn't think she's ever going to get there. It's something that we have to talk about because I'd rather her tell me than hold something in and not tell me something at all. I want you to be a thousand percent open with me. That's all I've ever wanted. Seeing you, meeting you, after your proposal, it was mm -hmm. all 100. And that's what I felt, and that's why I'm still here right now. But I feel as though once we got done with the experiment, you stop, you like put that roadblock in there. Just because it's an experiment that someone set up and said, hey, I think love is blind, you mm -hmm. can't come in with preconceived notions. You have to let the human element play out. We have this incredible, undeniable connection. But it has not turned for me. Okay. And I know we're about to go back to Atlanta and move into the next portion of this experiment. And I know fully I don't want to go meet your family with a ring on my finger. I can't do that to you. I can't do that to your family. To do this whole thing is not something that I feel comfortable with at this point. I'm not there yet. I don't think I should wear the ring. I'm just not comfortable. It doesn't feel authentic for me to wear this symbol of forever. Right now, I just feel like we are miles apart from each other. You can't fake all of that when I saw you. You can't fake the, the things that we said to each other in the past. All those emotions and everything was real. Getting down on one knee was real. But the experiment, it doesn't end there. See, it doesn't end at the pause. Like, I get it, it was safe. Like, I, there was no judgment. There was no insecurities. Mm -hmm. But like, there was none of it. Oh, no, 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 no,